All right, I'm Heather. I'm Jack. And today we have a grocery run to do. So we're going to kind of... kind of take you guys along with us this is a smaller one you may have seen the one where we went to um, Aldi and Meyer and Kroger mm -hmm. I did that one by myself but uh, so this one is a smaller one this is kind of like the I my husband gets paid every two weeks so this is kind of that second week and so we've got a budget of about I don't know like two hundred dollars so and I'm gonna try to stay under that and I'm just gonna take you with this as we go and Jack has to go to five below he has to get a charger for his tablet my my charger broke and now I'm using a charger that's about that long which makes it really hard for him because <laughs> because technically it doesn't even really plug into the wall with that long because it has to hang because our your outlets are higher than that yeah so all right so here we go All right, so we're at the Aldi's, and I'm at a different one than I usually go to. Uh, this one, um, it's my personal favorite. Well, it's his favorite. I, sometimes I don't like this one quite as much because some, okay, because I'm a creature of habit, and this store is set up a little different. And I'm like, I can't find anything, but that's my own my own fault. But this one's over by five below, and I didn't want to waste the gas making two separate trips going to two separate places. So we're going to go ahead and go to this Aldi's and get all the stuff that we need. We just got out of Aldi's, and we had a... Yeah, it is a little cold it's out there. Very, very, um, very, we had very a budget cold. of $200, and we did it for our 124 and change. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to head over to Gordon Foods and get some more kind of like bigger items like in bigger containers bigger bags um, usually I buy like my bread flour there we're gonna get some frozen broccoli there things that we can kind of back stock just a little but bit they had at Aldi's chicken thighs for uh, 69 cents a pound thighs, I thought it took things. no it's not chicken things chicken thighs for 69 cents a pound and then we got and this I remember and I will give credit where credit is due this um, uh, Lone Star Living, Jonathan over at Lone Star Living was talking about on certain days, Aldi's will put their meat half price. Well, today is a Friday over here, and now it's not the Friday at the other one that I go to, but Friday here, they put their ground beef on sale, and I got it for $1.09 a pound. So, good. awesome. So, thank you, Jonathan. <laughs> we are at Five Below right now. Jack's going to get his charging cord for his tablet. Now, I will tell you, at Five Below, you can actually find some really good deals on cookbooks, of all things. I've gotten some really great cookbooks from here, and I might, if I'm allowed, I might show you, like, what they have in there. All right, so here's what I was talking about. They have these crock pot and one pot meal cookbooks, and they're just $5. And I know, I believe that these were, like, maybe 15 20 dollars before so that's a really good deal on these cookbooks we are at gordon food right now so we're gonna go in and i totally forgot to get uh i'm making lasagna and i forgot to get cottage cheese which is okay because i can get giant vats of it here so we i'm making probably three or four sauce. yeah we forgot enchilada sauce we're making enchiladas this week so we're gonna go in to gordon food and see what we can do so this is everything that we got and we gotta get, Tina, go away. Don't like the bananas. So this is everything that we got. Um, and this is for two weeks. And I do have some stuff that I got just to kind of put back a little bit. But um, I can show you like right here, that's the chicken, the chicken thighs that I got. And they were um, 69 cents a pound. So I got a really good deal on that. And then this stuff here is the ground beef. And I figured it out. They had it half price at all these. I paid a dollar nine a pound for the ground beef there. So, uh, but that's all of our stuff that we got. I'm going to break down for you now just the price for everything that I got here. So, um, I spent a uh, let me think, hundred and seventy-seven dollars. I just kind of rounded up with everything. If there was change, I just rounded up to the next dollar. So, um, I did my math split it all apart so like I said this is shopping for two weeks and um, it was two dollars and ten cents per person 
per day, which means per day is breakfast, lunch, dinner, and then two snacks. So I, I think I did a pretty good job here. I mean, I, I had a, a budget of $200, so now that extra is gonna be in case you, because every once in a while you're like, you'll run out of butter, or you'll run out of milk, or you'll, you need to just go pick something, you forgot something like, you know, you forgot onions or something like that, and you need it for a dish. So I always kind of leave a little bit back just in case that happens, but that is our Aldi's and um, Gordon Foods and a little bit of Kroger's because what happened was I did forget something and I had to go get enchilada sauce over at Kroger's because I totally forgot to get it at either of the other places that we went to. So um, I hope you guys like this video. Um, leave any comments you have down below and more updates as we go. Bye.